Hey y'all, you know Don Russell, R. Kelly's former manager, you know the one that's about to do prison time for that fool? Yeah, he sat down with Chicago's early and Tia with an exclusive two-hour interview where he says he don't give a shit no more because they both had their trials and he's ready to spill the beans. But R. Kelly is planning to file appeals. So how is this going to help him? I don't think it will, but let's tune in and find out what he say. And she said then outside of the room with other girls hanging out that they weren't the top of the line girls, but they were just girls he had fun with. I'm like, okay. Obviously, you know about the king of R&B, R. Kelly, sitting behind bars for 30 years for sex trafficking, racketeering, and the list goes on. Now we're actually hearing from the man known as his manager, uh, also the muscle, Don Russell. I don't give a shit. If my trial is over with, his trial is pretty much over with, I'm gonna put it all out there. You never saw any underage girls around him in his entourage. You never saw any underage women, girls in his camp. And all these other motherfucking names that's attached to him know where the bodies are buried. They were there. What did you uncover that made you say he has a problem? I'm done. It was bullshit until, like I said, later on when I started thinking about it. Why you? Why, what's so significant about you? You eight months. You've been in this man's life for eight months. That was hush money to stop them from telling about them fucking 15 year olds that they witnessed him fucking. How? When he would come back, we would play games like musical chairs. Break that down for us. And he would be in the bed with Aaliyah and her mother at the same fucking time. I mean, I don't really want to hear that shit, but that's the fucking truth. So that's why ain't none of their asses on trial. Do you feel like so these the parents were aware of this? Fuck yeah. So the parents know. All of them knew. This ain't no, let me talk about, this man ain't at the door letting people in. It's got to go through this person, that person, that person, or a handler to get to him. You, if your daughter gone for four or five days and you knew the last thing you saw was at an R. Kelly concert, wouldn't you be on some shit with this nigga? Yeah.